Hi, Kevin Bach from LaserMax. Today I'm going to run you through installation of guide rod lasers for Gen 4 Glocks model 20 and 21. So before we get started, let's take a look at what comes in your guide rod box. In this envelope you'll find an operator's manual and a spacer which is required on these models of handguns. You'll have a box that contains your small parts and your install tools. And then you have your guide rod and recoil spring itself. Anytime we're working with springs, it's a good idea to wear a pair of safety glasses. So we can get started by ensuring both visually and physically that your firearm is unloaded and that there's no live ammunition in your workspace. At that point, you can take the slide off of the frame according to your Glock owner's manual. Set the slide off to the side. Using your installation tool provided in the kit, you can compress the slide lock spring and that will allow the slide lock to come out from the side of the gun. At this point, you should be able to turn the frame upside down and give it a tap on the table and the factory slide lock spring should come out. If not, you can use the provided tool to help pry this out of the space. We'll install our Laser Max slide lock spring, ensuring that it's going in the same notch that the factory came out of. Seat this down into the frame. With that installed, we'll now put in our Laser Max slide lock. You want to make sure that the painted tabs on the slide lock are oriented back towards you as you're holding onto the firearm. What I like to do is simply wedge the slide lock on top of the spring and catch it and then you can just use it as a little lever to. Now we can remove the factory guide rod and set that aside. Now you can insert your spacer and install the guide rod ensuring that the wedged portion of the battery cap is facing directly away from the barrel when you're putting it on the barrel lug. For warranty purposes, you want to take note of your laser's serial number, which will be printed on the body of the laser and is also on your original packaging. I'll put the slide back onto the frame. Your laser will be working. You could activate this from either side of the handgun using the slide lock. Activate it from the right or left hand side. And then in the center position, it'll be off. For more information on this and all other LaserMax products, check out our website, lasermax.com.